Okay, I'm glad that you have two because I've got two as well. Um, I was going to go with Sebastian Munoz. I was all in on him and then he withdrew. But um, I'm going to start with JT Poston, who's one of our Secret Golf contributors. You know, looking across the board at JT's stats, the, I don't think the stats are really telling the story of where his game's at, um, especially putting average. He's coming in at 129th right now. But remember that he didn't play the Fortinet, or did he? Did he play the Fortinet? Uh, uh, no, but he, he JT did. is one of the best putters on the whole PGA right? Tour. Yes. So I'm taking the stats right now um, with a pinch of salt because it's, uh, it's hard when the new season's underway and other people have played one tournament and they're immediately jumping ahead of someone like JT. But we saw him win late in the season at the John Deere. He'd finished second at the Travelers the week before that. Um, it, we saw him win before at the Wyndham. It's like JT Poston really picks up at the end of the season, but I'm hoping that the form's gonna continue at the start. He finished third here in 2020, 11th in 2019. You know, great ball striker, great putter. So I like JT Poston this week. This course just kind of fits his game. And then um, he is 16 to 1, so definitely a favourite this week. But I'm going to stick with Taylor Montgomery. So I gave you a Taylor um, coming off the Corn Ferry Tour to do well at the Fortinet, and he ended up finishing third. So, I mean, I, I love him. There's no way in the world I'm going to back off him now. Finished seventh in the Corn Ferry Tour season long points list and has to be feeling extra motivated after that great stop, start to his PGA Tour career. But um, he's a really good putter. He's a big hitter. Maybe just has to hone in his approach slash greens and reg a little bit. But, I mean, right now he's sitting at 21. He's sitting third in putting, sixth in par four performance. So Taylor Montgomery, I found him at 35 to one. Um, him and JT Poston, that's who I'm picking as my favourites. 